If you're anything like me and my family, you're having visions of vacay as spring temps heat up and the summer season starting to look a little extra bright this year. Visit California wants everyone to keep it Hotel California and explore all the wonders our home state has to offer. Visit California President and CEO Carolyn Butera is here now to help us with that California dreaming. Good morning, Carolyn. Well, thank you. And that's right, Aubrey. You're right. So what is Visit California doing to jumpstart travel within the state once it is safe? Well, as you know, spring 2021 is really just ripe for international travel messages. And now with the situation improving on the COVID front, we're rolling out a multi-layered campaign this spring to inspire travel, not only to Californians, but later in the cycle nationally. Uh, starting with a campaign called Calling All Californians, another layer called California Road Trip Republic, and a banner piece called What If California, our new centerpiece that really unleashes the power of possibility because people really want to thrive and live in the now. So the power of possibility through What If really inspires them to take that leap and, and get away. As a matter of fact, we have a great new website to inspire that. It's visitcalifornia.com forward slash what if. Carolyn, sometimes we forget how beautiful California is. And really, we have a little bit of everything here, no matter what your vacation desires may be. But I want you to also talk about why travel and tourism is such a big deal for the state. Well, right. I mean, we're just blessed with an abundance of riches and and we actually have been able to successfully monetize that experience. Uh, we're the number one travel destination in the nation. And prior to COVID, uh, we directly employed 1.2 million workers uh, throughout California and it generated $145 billion in spending. COVID brought a precipitous drop of 60% in spending as well as jobs. So we really need people to help bring back the economy to post COVID levels uh, and get people back to work. Now, how are you asking people to support the state's travel industry as it does try to overcome some of these side effects from the pandemic? Well, the best thing about that is, is really just asking people to consider California first and foremost which is pretty much a natural trend because a lot of people are looking at regional travel. And, and that is the spending in California that gets those jobs going again. Uh, just, you know, during some of this COVID period, we were experiencing a leakage factor of about a billion dollars to Mexico where Californians were traveling to Mexico to vacation. So just the pure option of traveling in California uh, is in a huge boost to the economy. I hear you. And so when you talk about that regional travel or even just traveling in the state, the good thing is we can just hop in the car and go. We could take a road trip. That's exactly right. Road trips were very popular before COVID and then became even more popular after COVID. So where are you uh, suggesting Northern Californians head out to? Well, many options, uh, you know, just right outside our back door, our amazing gold country full of history and outdoor adventure. Of course, our north coast with the redwood groves and our wine regions. And even really close by, um, there's a great Central Valley road trip that starts um, just down Highway 99 in Galt. That's on our website as well. And if you just even head up north, you've got beautiful upstate California with Shasta and Lassen to explore as well. Those are some great ideas. And obviously we know that people want to travel safely. Um, any suggestions on how to really prioritize that when they're making their travel plans along with anything else they should expect when traveling this year? Yeah, and that's first and foremost because many different communities are different. Uh, we saw an abundance of travelers for the first time to our outdoor regions like Lake Tahoe, and then uh, really a wane in travelers to the Bay Area. So there's this unevenness and a differing in, in protocols. So we put together a responsible travel hub at Visit California, and it really talks about a code around respect California and travel responsibly. And that is also um, 
uh, something that perhaps prospective travelers would like to link to at visitcalifornia.com. Well, those are all great suggestions and reminders. Planning is key, but keep it in California, at least for the next year or so. And for Golden State trip inspiration, you can check out visitcalifornia.com. This interview involves commercial content. The products and services featured appear as paid advertising.